Your kid's jewelry could have the dangerous metal cadmium in it, and now dozens of big name stores, including Target and Saks, are pulling that kind of jewelry off the store shelves permanently. Jennifer Westoven is here, and she brought us some of the first stories about the discovery of cadmium in kids' jewelry. Good morning. Good morning, Robin. Um, this is a good story, and it means that all costume jewelry is going to get safer. A lot of big name stores got sued when a consumer group did all this testing, and they found that a lot of that beautiful, cheap jewelry that you see, it's so shiny, and how could it be so cheap? It was made with the poisonous metal cadmium that causes cancer and kidney damage. The LA Times reports that now 26 stores, including Target, Saks, and Hot Topic, have agreed, and these are many stores, that they are going to have strict rules about cadmium in the future. And by the way, not just your kids' jewelry, all jewelry. So that is a really good sign. I'll tell you, Robin, after some of those reports earlier, I've been afraid to buy costume jewelry because they were all about kids, which meant they were, you know they were making the stuff for us in it. And no, is it as I wonder if it's as dangerous for adults as it is for kids. I know that as a child when you're developing, yeah. then that is especially dangerous. But hey, probably not. But it's still dangerous. It's le it's called the seventh most dangerous um, toxic metal by the EPA. So what happened was when the government banned lead, these Chinese factories said, "Oh, we're just going to use cadmium. We don't have rules about cadmium." Because the stuff is so bad that nobody ever thought anybody would put that in a product. Isn't that something? Yeah. They never. They thought we don't need a rule because it's so awful. Yeah. Exactly. All right. So now we do have the rules, and some of those stores are going to be pulling it off the store shelves. Thank you for telling us about that.